Hey, welcome to Cosmic Tides. We're going to see how the cosmic currents are pulling for Scorpio. This is going to be a timeless reading, so you guys can watch this video whenever it finds you. Keep in mind that time is fluid, so you may not be able to resonate with this reading right now, and that's totally okay. Feel free to watch any of my old videos, or even come back next week, because I may be picking up your energy then. Okay, what is going on for the lovely Scorpios? Also, happy birthday to all the Scorpios out there. Okay, so this is kind of interesting and just like a little bit toxic, I'm not gonna lie, because I am seeing like if you're dealing with someone, this person gets really turned on when you guys argue, like this person just thinks you're so sexy when you're mad, and I'm actually seeing like you could be having an argument with this person and if they have a dick, like their dick is getting hard basically. Um, but to this person, like, these are not, like, real arguments. Like, you or this person can definitely start, like, little arguments if you guys are, like, wanting more attention. Or maybe if you guys are jealous over something and this person likes that because in their mind, they're like, wow, this person must really like me if they're having this reaction. And in some sick way, it makes them really happy. It makes them feel really wanted and, like I said, definitely turns them on. And yeah, this person likes these kind of arguments because to this person, they are not real arguments. It's kind of like both of your inner children are just like fighting for love, basically. Um, but this person does not like when you guys have like real arguments. When you guys have real arguments, it like really makes this person feel like a small helpless child. Like it makes this person feel horrible when you're actually mad at them, even though like this person really likes your angry face like you guys make this resting bitch face when you're angry that like you guys actually look like scary and also like frighteningly hot if that makes sense like no matter how actually mad you are or like how intimidated this person is of you like they can't help but to still want to touch you even when you're like fuming and I just see you being like really mad and being like don't fucking touch me which is making this person want to touch you even more because like they can't resist you even when you're pissed at them yeah it's like every time you're mad at this person like it just makes them want to kiss and make up that much more especially because this person sees a happy ending with you this is like something that's long term this is something happy this person also feels like yeah there may be other fish in the sea but like you're a fucking dolphin and this person does not see their future with anyone else but you so yeah it's like as fast as you get mad at them like they're wanting to make up that much faster because like this person really doesn't want to lose you and like they don't like when you stay mad at them for long especially if you guys like stop talking when you're really pissed like if you give this person the silent treatment like that's actually what makes them nervous like they rather have you yell at them than be silent basically because like if you're silent then this person knows like oh shit like I really fucked up 
And this person cannot stand when you don't talk to them because it makes them feel like they have like the very real possibility of like losing you forever and that is not what this person wants because like I said, they see like a happily ever after with you basically. So like if you're currently going through it with this person, I definitely see they're gonna try to come in and like smooth things over with you because they do not want to lose you. Like this person wants to make sure you guys are secure. So this is basically telling me that you guys can be like actually mad at this person for real not like one of those little play fights like you guys are actually pissed at this person for something and it's making this person feel really like uneasy and anxious as fuck right now because like they don't know if you guys are good if your relationship is secure and it's just really scaring them to think that they could possibly be losing you forever okay so that's what i got for you guys some signs that popped up in here i see Scorpio, Leo, Taurus, Cancer, Libra, Virgo, Gemini, Taurus, or a Taurus moon, Aquarius, Pisces, Aries, Cancer. Okay, so that's what I got for you guys. Make sure you check your chart. Whoever you're connecting with, go check out their chart too. And check out my brand new song, Slomo featuring Wild Boy Slink. Link is going to be down below. And all the information you need to book a personal reading with me is going to be down below. And you guys, keep being great. I'll see you next week. Bye! Slow motion, you cut my chest open Just like the ocean, emotion overflowing I'm frozen, a wave got me frozen Overdosing, everything slow motion